The Portuguese man O. Ward is not a single organism, but a colonial organism composed of four different types of polyps working together. It belongs to the class Hydrozoa and is closely related to jellyfish, though it is not a true jellyfish. Despite its appearance, the Portuguese man O. Ward is not a single organism but a siphonophore, a colonial organism made up of specialized polyps. It is commonly found in warm ocean waters worldwide, particularly in tropical and subtropical regions. The Portuguese man O. War gets its name from its resemblance to 18th century Portuguese warships, with their triangular sails. The sail of the Portuguese man O. War is actually a gas filled bladder, or nematophore, which acts as a buoyancy aid, allowing it to float on the ocean surface. Beneath the nematophore are long, venomous tentacles that can extend up to 165 feet, 50 meters, in length. These tentacles contain specialized, cells called nematocysts, which release venomous toxins to capture and immobilize prey. The venom of the Portuguese man O. War is powerful and can cause painful stings to humans, sometimes leading to severe allergic reactions. Despite their potent venom, Portuguese man O. War are not aggressive predators and rely on drifting with ocean currents to capture prey. They primarily feed on small fish, plankton, and other small organisms, that become ensnared in their tentacles. Portuguese man o war are subject to predation by certain species of sea turtles, fish, and seabirds that are immune to their venom. The larvae of Portuguese man o war are pelagic, drifting in ocean currents until they develop into mature colonies. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel.